It's me, Niles Ashton. We're back. Uh, I got a special guest for you guys, Yemma and Kelly. Y'all living? Yeah, bro. It's a funny comedian right here. One of the funniest guys on the scene. I love watching him do stand up. Uh, thankfully, he came in and could be our special guest. Thanks for being on the show, bro. Nah, no problem. No problem. Had to be on the, the Halloween show. Yeah, the Halloween, Halloween show. show. You got bullet holes in yeah. your jacket. So, what, uh, you like a Black Lives Matter activist for Halloween or something like that? Uh, I got my Luke Cage on. <laughs> <laughs> Big difference. Big do all right, Luke Cage. That's cool. Yeah, bulletproof. Yeah, be a bulletproof black man. They never let that happen in yeah. real life. Heck no. I don't. I don't know if I want some bulletproof black people around, dude. Look, there's certain people who couldn't find out they was bulletproof. Like, have, it, have you have you seen uh, Juice? Yeah, that's my movie. Don't let don't let the, don't let him find out he's bulletproof, cause yeah. Like, <laughs> That's a black horror movie, dog. Yeah, Juice That's is the first I black think, horror I movie. I definitely think Juice is kind of a horror movie. Just like the way... Get Tupac, Out is? Yeah, the way Tupac's character changes over time. It's very horror movie villainy, you know? Yeah. Like, it's, just a, it's just in the hood. It's just a different setting, you know? It's just, it's I don't same. think horror should be set to any setting. It could be anywhere. You know? Exactly. It's just like how Get Out was like... That's the reason Get Out's like a black horror movie. Yeah. It's because the fear is that at any point in time... Yeah. You can mess with a white girl. Exactly. And just like any, at any point in time, the homie could get a gun. Juice. Exactly. <laughs> and yeah, horror horror is about your biggest fears and what makes them real and what makes them scary and over exaggerates them. And that's what those two movies do. Just in a black cultural way. So yeah, you're right. That's dope. That's a good way to look at horror movies. It's not so much the concept and the monster and all this kind of thing. It's just like what scares you. Yeah, completely. Yeah. Like, just like, yeah, everything is just... The way it's supposed, like it, it's if you don't frame it as a black movie, yeah, and just take like just take it as what it is. Take the script and find out what it is. Yeah, that's just scary. That's dope. <laughs> Juice, Juice is one of my favorite movies, man. I love it. It's crazy. So Tupac, like, it's I feel like that role kind of uh, changed who he was as a person almost. Like after that movie was over, because I think he really embraced that whole like thug life. I don't give a damn about nothing anymore like after he played Bishop so I think Bishop kind of changed him a little bit uh I think I think it was how much people let it like it's after he found out like he, like what he because you know like you live your whole because like I was corny for so long yeah like I was corny until I was like until like 22 <laughs> and I couldn't get it I couldn't get nothing for it like and then I was like all right fuck morals <laughs> 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 Conscience gone. That's funny, bro. 